This is Marlon. Today is Saturday, July 26th, and here are today's saints of the day, Saints Joachim and Anne. In the scriptures, Matthew and Luke furnish a legal family history of Jesus, tracing ancestry to show that Jesus is the culmination of great promises. Not only is his mother's family neglected, we also know nothing factual about them except that they existed. Even the names Joachim and Anne come from legendary sources written more than a century after Jesus died. The heroism and holiness of these people, however, is inferred from the whole family atmosphere around Mary in the scriptures. Whether we rely on the legends about Mary's childhood or make guesses from the information in the Bible, we see in her a fulfillment of many generations of prayerful persons, herself steeped in the religious traditions of her people. The strong character of Mary in making decisions, her continuous practice of prayer, her devotion to the laws of her faith, her steadiness at moments of crisis, and her devotion to her relatives all indicate a close-knit, loving family that looked forward to the next generation, even while retaining the best of the past. Joachim and Anne, whether these are their real names or not, represent that entire quiet series of generations who faithfully perform their duties, practice their faith, and establish an atmosphere for the coming of the Messiah, but remain obscure. They just live out their lives, and uh, but the Lord notices. I have a little uh, quote from uh, Vatican II's pastoral, is it? pastoral constitution on the church in the modern world, number 52. The family is the foundation of society. In it, the various generations come together and help one another to grow wise and to harmonize personal rights with the other requirements of social life. And so, if your grandparents are, are still alive or a grandparent, call them, tell them you love them, spend time with them. And let us ask for the prayers of our saints of the day, as we say. Saints Joachim and Anne, pray for us. We love you.